So today, we're launching the largest left of labour, working class and socialist electoral alternative this country has seen for 60 years. Hi, my name's Steve North. I'm standing as the Tusk prospective parliamentary candidate for Worsley and Eccles South. My name's Carl Harper and I'll be standing for the Trade Unionist and Socialist Coalition in Peterborough. My name's Katie Simpson and I'm going to be standing for local council in Bradwell Ward of Milton Keynes and for parliament in north of Milton Keynes. Glenn Hart, I'm standing as a Tusk candidate um, because I think I can make a big difference to my local area. As a former member of the Labour Party, I'm disgusted by the way that Labour has failed in any way, shape or form to oppose what this Tory Lib Dem government has done. I'm standing to give ordinary people a voice inside the council chamber. Fighting against austerity, not just voting against the cuts, but actively in fighting against the cuts. And I think it's about time that we in Salford and within the Worsley and Eccles South constituency stop letting them take our votes for granted. I had 36 years in nursing and I do care about people, especially the vulnerable, the disabled, I, as a disabled candidate, I worked in my local community for over 30 years supporting the so-called vulnerable and isolated communities. The reason I'm standing is because many years ago my husband worked down at Pitt with a job that was going to last him to his pension age and they closed all those pits in our area and I've been part of that ex-minor community and I've seen austerity over the last 30 years. All the main political parties want to continue austerity and cuts. Many people have stopped voting. What's on offer in Parliament doesn't represent much hope. In ex-minor communities, we've seen the implications of that and how it divides people and causes the social distress. My name's Martin Powell Davis. I'm member of the NUT National Executive. I'm standing in this election for Tusk in Lewis and Western Penge to offer a real alternative to cuts and privatisation. I want to be part of building a, a genuine working class fight back against the Tory assault upon the whole of my class. 60 people have committed suicide as a result of their benefits being cut. We've seen firsthand the cuts being carried through to communities across the city, the cuts to bus services, the cuts to local adventure playgrounds. We've been campaigning against the closure of the Women's Refuge in Exeter, which is a vital service. The constituency where I'm standing is represented by Labour Lewisham Council and Tory Bromley Council. Yet for ordinary people, they'll see the same in both areas. Cuts, attacks, attempts to turn schools into an academy. Well, I work in the NHS, I'm a shop steward locally. And what we have in our area, in Bristol and around the, the district of, of Bristol, is a crisis in the NHS, with French Day Hospital being closed. South Mead Hospital run on what's known as the Private Finance Initiative, which is taking money out of the NHS to give money to shareholders. I believe we need to give some hope to our young people. We live in a borough where we see millions coming into our borough it's through the banks and the other big financial institutions that are based there. But none of that trickles down to the people that live there, particularly the youth. When you've got all the main parties echoing UKIP's argument that the reason why there aren't enough jobs, the reason why there aren't enough housing is because there's too many immigrants, we've got to take that argument head on. There's money nationally, there's money locally. There's a whole range of cuts in social provision. Whilst the wealthy in this country continue to pile up enormous wealth, while the Bullington boys, the rich, the millionaires party, continues to drive down living standards and transfer wealth to the already obscenely rich. Tusk is the only party that identifies the real problems. We're having to pay for all the billions that we've given to the banks. We're having to pay by cuts in our social services, cuts in adult social care, cuts in our wages, in our benefits, in our pensions. Too much wealth, all the wealth that is being produced has been transferred from poor people and working class people to the very rich. Tusk has identified that as the problem and Tusk knows what the solution is. The solution is to get that money back to do that by means of renationalisation, ending the anti-trade union laws. Hi, my name is Councillor Dean Kerr. I'm from Hull. I'm a part of Hull Red Labour. 
um, was Labour councillor. Just wanted to say that's the first conference I've been to with Tusk. And I can honestly say, after listening to everything that's gone on today, I believe that Tusk is actually in the original Labour Party, what it was originally founded for, what it was originally stood for. Working people, and I can't wait to see the elected candidates in 2015. Good afternoon, comrades. I bring you greetings from Harrow. Um, I'm one of the rebel councillors. Nine of us initially left. Yeah. And Labour's attitude is if you stand against that at your peril. There's actually a culture of coercion. People aren't allowed to speak their minds. If you speak your mind, you are threatened. And it takes, I think, a little more backbone that people are exhibiting these days to actually say, actually, that's not what we believe in. If you are left-wing, you're socialist, you need to stand up for those values. Having said that, I do really believe that there's an alternative to austerity, there's an alternative to cuts. It is not the uh, budget deficit that leads to all this. The deficit was bigger after the war. We still brought in the NHS, we still brought in council housing. So I'm very hopeful that this will be start of a real process of building Tusk as a, as a national, as, as a stepping stone towards a national, a new socialist, mass socialist party in this country. So if you feel strongly about people, please get involved with Tusk. We've had enough. We want something different. We don't want cuts. So support Tusk, the trade union and socialist coalition in the general election and in the council elections and let's make sure that we have a party that's going to stand up for ordinary people against austerity, against cuts, against privatisation. Because I think it's high time we show people that there's an alternative to this way of chasing money and not caring about people. Thank you very much.